In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Apple Keyboard to Windows 11. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. The Apple Keyboard, also known as the Magic Keyboard, can easily be connected to a PC running Windows. You will have two options to do this. You can either do this wirelessly using Bluetooth, Bluetooth or through a cable. I'm going to showcase both in this video, starting with the Bluetooth option. So for this one, go into the Bluetooth settings on your Windows PC, so Bluetooth and devices, and make sure that Bluetooth has been enabled. With this done, set your keyboard into pairing mode. So if you look at the top, you will find this button here. You have to make sure that it is set to the appropriate position when you see this green background on the button. When you see this green background, it indicates that it is in the correct position and that it is now in pairing mode. So if you choose the option to add a device, now that you have powered on the keyboard, it is going to appear over here on the list. So you will see the Apple keyboard appear and all that you have to do is select it. Immediately upon doing this, it will be connected to the PC and it will remain connected. Every single subsequent time that you power it on, it should automatically pair itself to the Windows PC. If you have a MacBook or a Mac desktop nearby, or any other device that you have connected the Magic Keyboard to, and it isn't connecting to the Windows PC, it could be because it is trying to connect itself to other devices. So make sure that they aren't powered on, and that the keyboard exclusively connects to the PC running Windows 11. Besides this, if you don't want to use Bluetooth, then the only other option is to use a cable. If you look at the top of your Magic Keyboard, where you can see the on and off switch that I mentioned earlier, you will find the port. It is either going to be USB-C or Lightning, depending on the model. So check your particular model and see what port you have available. Once you detect the port, all that you have to do is use a cable. One end goes into the keyboard and the other one goes into your PC or laptop. Just plug it into the appropriate port, depending on which adapter you want to use or which cable you are using. And as long as you can establish the wired connection, it is also going to work. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Apple Keyboard to Windows 11. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.